the new MetaPerson avatars can be easily integrated into the Unreal Engine projects. To learn how to add lifelike avatars to your application, see the official GitHub repository. At first you need to obtain the sample project, clone it with Git or simply download the archive to the destination folder. Please note that Unreal Engine 5 and Visual Studio 2022 must be installed on your computer in order to run the sample. Extract the data from the downloaded archive. Go to the Projects folder and open the project file. The dialog window asks you if you want to recompile modules of your project. Click Yes and wait for the compiler to complete its work. Once completed, the Unreal Engine window will appear. You can see the modified third-person template level loaded. If you try to play this level, you will see the warning message which tells that you need to provide some additional parameters. Let's exit the simulation and find the avatar SDK MetaPerson part of the plugin settings. Client ID and client secret are the parameters required to export your MetaPerson avatars. To obtain them you need to get an Avatar SDK developer account at accounts.avatarsdk.com slash developer slash signup. Open the HTTP API tab in the developer section. Choose the Client Credentials option in the Authorization Grant fields and type any name in the Application Name control. Then press the Submit button to get your credentials for using Avatar SDK. Copy the App Client ID and App Client Secret from the Client Access application at the Developer section. Now we are ready to go. Playing the level opens the MetaPerson Creator UI. After that, all the functions for creating and customizing an avatar become available to you. Let's create an avatar from a photo. We can customize our avatar before exporting to an Unreal Engine scene. We can change the outfit. And then the hairstyle. When your avatar is ready, you can press the export button. It takes a little bit of time. Please note that if you've incorrectly added your credentials, or if your account doesn't have a pro plan or higher, the export button may be inactive. Once the export is ready, you can test your avatar in the scene. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to reach our support. Thank you for watching and good luck with your project.